Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you how to set up an auto exec file for CS2. So what you want to do is you want to go in Steam, then Library, and after that you want to right click on CSGO, go to Manage, and then Browse Local Files. Once you are here, you want to go into Game, after that you want to go into CSGO, and then CFG. So right here, uh, you will not have this auto exec file. So what you want to do is, these files here are going to be CFG, so you can just check by right clicking and going to properties, and you'll see that the type of file is CFG. So if it's CFG, what you can do is you can copy it and paste it. Then you can change the name to auto exec. I'm going to type auto exec 2 so it's not the same name as this one. And then you can go in and you can delete everything from here. And you can set up your auto exec. So now I'm going to show you what I have in my auto exec so you can type in the same things except one command. So I have binds for, first of all, this is the normal jump throw and this is the run throw. So you want this command to jump throw and also you, you can change this key to whatever key you like. I like to have it on N. So this will be for the jump throw. This will be for the jump and run throw. So it's basically like pressing W and jump throwing. But it's on one key so it's more consistent and easier. So you want to have this and here you can also type the key that you want to set it up on. And here in these commands are going to help you with uh, if you have ever experienced the issue of getting killed through walls or if you have experienced issues with your sprays, these commands are going to help a lot. Cell update rate 128, cell interp ratio 1, and here on cell interp you want to have this value if your internet is not very stable. But if you have a more stable internet, you can have another value that I'm going to put in the description of this video. And everything from this auto exec is going to be in the description. So you can check it from there. And now we can go into CS2 and I can show you how to execute the file and how it works. Once you're in the game, what you want to do is you want to open your console and type exec auto exec like this. And after you do that, all of the commands will be put in. So if you want to check, you can type the update rate, and you see it's 128. You can type interp, and you can see the interp is the same as in the auto exec, and the interp ratio is 1. The default values are different for uh, this, it's 2, for this, I'm not sure, and for update rate, the default value is 20. But these values make it much better, so you don't get cute thing walls, and so your experience are easier, and also the jump throw binds are going to work, so it's easier for you to throw nades. So if this video helped you, if you learned something new, make sure to leave a like, and subscribe to my channel to not miss out on any upcoming CS2 content. Thank you for watching.